Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. So as you can tell from the title of the video, today I have a huge H&M haul. I don't know what it is about H&M at the moment, but they are literally just making some amazing clothing pieces. Like I'm literally just obsessed with every single thing they have in their store at the moment, um, which hasn't really been the best for my bank account, to be honest. I have literally so much stuff, which was done over a course of about like five trips to H&M. So I didn't buy all of this at once. I went into off with some of the pieces and other pieces I ordered online over about five different times so just bear that in mind I didn't buy this all at once but I have been spending a hell of a lot of money in H&M at the moment and yeah I thought I'd share with you the pieces that I picked up because I think that they're really nice okay so the first thing that I picked up was this shacket now I didn't even know what a shacket was until about three weeks ago when I picked up this jacket. It's like a shirt jacket, you know you know what it is. Yeah, I didn't even know what these were. I had literally just discovered this on H&M and I saw it online and it literally just looked so, so beautiful. It was only $24.99, so I really wanted to pick it up. I did originally want this in a size small or a medium, but they were completely sold out. And by the time I made it into the store, the only size they had left was a large. And I just, by that point, I wanted it so bad that I just bought it in the large. So the large is is quite oversized on me but actually I don't hate the way it looks I'm obviously gonna put in clips of me wearing the pieces as well so you can see what it looks like it's just very kind of baggy and oversized this will be perfect with like thick kind of hoodies underneath or like thick jumpers or anything like that so it'll keep me nice and warm for the kind of autumn and winter months but I just really thought this was a bargain for like $24.99 and I did actually have a 10% off discount code because I use the app so yeah love this they did it in a beige and a gray I did want to get both but I could only get my hands on the grey unfortunately. By the way guys I'm filming on a new lens. I don't know if you can tell if the quality is better or the lighting is better in my videos but this lens is a lot brighter than my last lens so please do let me know if you can tell a difference in the quality of my videos because this lens cost me a bloody arm and a leg so I hope you can. Okay so the next thing that I picked up I've actually been picking up a load of jumpers recently mostly from H&M because that's pretty much where I've been doing like all of my shopping recently for clothing. I just realised that my wardrobe doesn't really have that many jumpers so I kind of just like stocked up on jumpers because they're literally like the coziest things to wear in the autumn winter I love wearing them so this is one of the jumpers that I picked up as you can see is this really beautiful kind of like white slash cream v-neck jumper this is in that kind of really nice like super soft material um it does do that thing where little furs come off of it which is a tiny bit annoying especially when you're wearing lip gloss but nonetheless this is such a cute jumper and it's a really lovely kind of oversized fit I did get this in a size medium I believe oh I cut out the label that's helpful so yeah I believe I got this in a medium and it just fits really nice and oversized I've been wearing this with kind of leggings and boots and I did also have it kind of pictured in my mind with like a shirt underneath with the collar kind of poking out because it's the v-neck I think it'll work really really nicely but obviously we're not really going anywhere to look kind of like dressed up at the moment because it's locked down 2.0 so I'll probably just wear it as like a normal jumper just like cozy around the house but I really really love this one and I think this was around $24.99 as well but I'll link everything down below if I can find it oh everything's inside out I hate myself I'm really not like the most fashionable person ever like I'm really I'm mostly just into makeup I'm not really a fashionista like that don't really know how to dress most of the time but I'm really trying to get into like fashion because I feel like my fashion just needs like updating so hence why I've been doing loads of clothing shopping so the next jumper that I got is actually this roll neck one and I have worn this so this needs to go in the wash literally straight after this video but I've been really enjoying roll neck jumpers just purely because I feel like when you wear a roll neck and then you wear any kind of jacket jacket or coat over the top your neck doesn't get cold obviously but it's just a really nice kind of added little detail to have I think it looks really nice and it just keeps you that little bit warmer without having to bother with a scarf so I got this one this one is obviously in this really nice kind of light pale grey colour this is really really cute again I've just been wearing this with leggings or just like some plain skinny jeans I did get this in a size small this one is quite oversized already so if you want it really oversized then I would say size up but it is quite oversized just like in the original Original size that you would normally be anyway but yeah absolutely love this one it's a really kind of super soft material as well okay so let's just deviate away from jumpers for the second so I actually picked up this blazer this as you can see is a really nice light gray kind of white and black check I guess you would call this I don't really have any blazers in my wardrobe I think this is like the only one 
now that I own and I just love the look of blazers with like skinny jeans or like leather look pants with jumpers underneath or crop tops or whatever they literally just look so chic and that's the style that I've been really trying to like do at the moment just like that kind of chic effortless look and I feel like this blazer is that and it's got these really nice kind of like black tortoiseshell buttons this is actually quite thick as well like it's not like a normal blazer that you would just kind of wear like to work or whatever if you work in that type of thing it's actually more of like a coat like it's got kind of like padding in the shoulders so I feel like if you wore like a nice chunky jumper underneath like the one that I just showed and put on some skinny jeans like this could literally be your coat probably not in mid-winter but yeah this is definitely thicker than a normal blazer and I think this one it doesn't have the price for some reason but I think this one was around $24.99 as well and I picked this one up in a size 8. Okay so next I picked up this really kind of plain and basic item but to be honest you can never really have enough of these kind of tops in your wardrobe they're just really easy to kind of throw on and put some jeans or leggings on like underneath. So this is like this kind of thin linen-y style cream roll neck or high neck I don't even know what these are called, but you know, it sits quite high up the collar. This is very thin. I was expecting this because I ordered this one online. I was expecting it to be a tiny bit thicker. I wish it was because obviously it would be a little bit warmer for winter, but it's fine because you can definitely layer with this. You could even put like a, a jumper, kind of like a round neck jumper on the top of this, like a sweater style one and have this poking out and that will look really nice. And it's just nice to have these in your wardrobe just for like layering and stuff like that. This one I got in an extra small because obviously Obviously I wanted it to fit like perfectly and I believe it was around $7.99 so it was really super inexpensive. Okay so I did actually, I just ruined my eyebrow. Oh no, we're good. Okay, so I did actually pick up a skirt because I've been really enjoying the look. And when I say the look, I'm talking about just like Instagram, like fashion accounts. I've been really loving the look of kind of like skirts with big oversized jumpers, tights, boots, coats, like that kind of vibe. I really, really like that style in autumn. Not that I'm really going anywhere to be wearing a skirt, but hopefully we'll be out of lockdown soon. So I picked up this really nice kind of leather look, camel colored skirt. As you can see, it kind of like goes a little bit tight and then it kind of like has this like flare peplum bit out of the bottom can you tell that i don't do these fashion videos often <laughs> literally i don't know what anything's called but yeah this is really nice it's got this really nice zip at the back it is quite short obviously the little frill bit does add a little bit of length but without that it's really quite short but yeah this is the kind of skirt that i would only really wear with tights anyway i feel like the color is very sorry about my dog i feel like the color is very kind of autumnal so it's like perfect for this time of year if i do actually get the chance to wear it okay so another jumper that i actually picked up was this black one this you're not really going to be able to see that well here but obviously in the trunk clip you'll see it a bit better so this one is actually a cropped jumper and it has this really nice kind of like ruched detail down the center that you can actually kind of like ruche higher or lower depending on where you want the crop to sit so I really liked this kind of style I think this will look really nice with some kind of like high-waisted mum jeans and some boots and a little coat over the top yeah I really like this I think yeah I picked this up in an extra small and this is quite like oversized actually for an extra small I would say this looks more like like a medium so if you want it to be oversized I'd probably say only like size up one but this is quite oversized anyway I can't remember off the top of my head how much this one was I ordered it online um but I believe it was around 15 pounds and yeah it's kind of like this nice kind of thick chunky knit material it's not like itchy or anything I haven't worn this one yet but I'm thinking that this is probably going to go with so much stuff okay so I'm going to go on to this piece now because this is actually my favorite item in the whole haul and this is actually the most expensive one as well so this is the this beautiful thick ribbed jumper this is again like a roll neck one but this one is slightly more like structured than the other one I don't know if you can tell what I mean it kind of like sits more like structured this is super thick and like this is a really heavy weight jumper I absolutely love this I mean this was 35 pounds which for me paying 35 pound for a jumper is just like I don't think I've ever paid £35 for a jumper. I don't know if I'm just a cheapskate, but for me, £35 is actually quite expensive for a jumper, especially as it's not like wool or anything like that. It's literally just from like H&M. This I was actually looking at online, but I had to return a couple of items. So I ended up going in the store to return them. And then I thought I might as well just like pick up this while I'm there. So when I got there, I'm so glad I did actually go in the store to get this because the small was literally, which was the size I was going to order. It was so small. And I really did want this to be quite open 
over sized. So I ended up actually picking this up in a size large, which at the time I was like, I don't know if this is gonna be too big, but there was only one medium left and it had a hole in it. So I wasn't gonna buy that. So yeah, I picked this one up in a large and to be honest, this fits like absolutely perfectly how I'd want it to. It's really super kind of oversized and cozy. I just know that this is literally gonna keep me like so warm throughout the winter. But yeah, I'm really happy that I got this one. I was, I'm an Anarum because obviously it's a little bit more expensive than what I would usually spend on a jumper. But I'm actually really pleased that I picked this one up. It's literally like one of my favorite pieces in the whole haul. Okay, so the next item that I picked up was actually this tunic slash tank top slash overlay thing. I don't really know what to call this, but this is basically a jumper with no sleeves. So I actually, this was the first thing that I actually bought from H&M. So I've had this for about a month now. I've been sort of like keeping it to put in the haul. I don't know if this is sold out or not, but if it is, I'll try and link some similar ones down below. But I just really love these tank tops at the moment. They're really in, they're very kind of like Instagrammy and they're very kind of on trend at the moment. But yeah, I've worn this a couple times already and I've just put like a white shirt underneath, which is how I plan on wearing it. I don't really know how well she, could wear this unless you put like like a really sort of like tight ribbed top on underneath like a long sleeve one i was planning to wear this with kind of like a skirt poking out underneath so like a little black skirt poking out underneath some boots and some tights but i haven't really gone anywhere to be that dressy so i've just ended up wearing this with leggings or sort of like leather look pants but yeah this is a really cute kind of like winter piece i did pick this up in a size medium again i had a similar situation where i wanted it in a small but they didn't have it so i ended up going for the medium i probably would have preferred it in a small because i feel like this looks a little bit like it doesn't fit me that well you'll probably see in the try and clip however i think it looks fine like it doesn't look like it's drowning me too much so i am gonna obviously keep it and i have worn it anyway so okay so the next thing that i picked up was actually a skirt this skirt i don't know when or where i'm gonna wear this skirt to be honest but it's one of those pieces that i saw it and i thought you know what, I'm just gonna get that because I love it so much and I will find a time and place to wear it in the near future, hopefully. As you can see, this is the most beautiful kind of like shiny khaki color. And it's one of these kind of long mid-axi, I think you would call it, skater skirt. I have one of these in lilac that I picked up from Zara that I'm yet to wear as well because we literally didn't go anywhere in the summer and now we're probably not going anywhere in the winter. But I really enjoy the way these skirts look on other people and I'm hoping that I can pull it off as well. I think this was only like 12 99 it doesn't say. Yeah, I think this was only like 12 99 or something on the website. So I thought I am gonna pick this up. It's definitely kind of like Christmas vibes. I don't know, I just love the color. It's so like autumnal and cute. So yeah, with just like a white jumper or even just like a cute little white top, I think this will look really nice. Okay, so moving on to another little kind of like jumper piece. I picked up this cute little white cardigan. So this is actually a cropped cardigan. It's got these three white buttons and how I plan to wear this is basically just like completely done up at the front with some high-waisted jeans and this is like to be worn as a top rather than a cardigan if that makes sense you could definitely kind of like layer this over like a crop top or something but I'm planning on literally just wearing it like as a top it's not the thickest thing in the world but it's also not the thinnest so this will definitely keep me warm but I'll 100% need to wear like a coat over the top I believe this one was around 12 99 so it wasn't too pricey at all and I did pick this one up in an extra small okay so I've got two pieces left the next piece that I picked up was another skirt and this is a black kind of faux leather skirt this time I do actually have a black leather skirt but it's from Primark and I've worn it to death and it's kind of like you know it's showing signs of quite heavy wear now so I thought I'd pick up another one I believe this one was quite inexpensive I think I didn't pay more than like 15 pounds for it so as you can see it's this really nice kind of black faux leather it's got these quite nice like stitching details towels down the side and like along the front which I thought was quite a nice little added detail it makes it look a little bit more expensive thought I could wear this again like I said earlier like with one of the jumpers with this kind of poking out with some tights and some boots I wear my black leather skirt from Primark to work all the time so when I eventually go back to work I can definitely wear this to work as well because I love wearing that one I thought I might as well pick up another one and this one feels probably slightly better quality than my Primark one as well okay and then the last item that I have to show you is probably again one of my favorite pieces from the whole haul this is this huge very kind of thick and chunky cable knit sweater this is obviously in this really nice kind of like cream color and it's got these kind of like the cable knit kind of stops and then it goes into like a ribbed thing for the sleeve this I actually bought in store as well and I'm really happy I did because I really wanted to see like what the sizes actually looked like in real life so I ended up going for a medium with this one I was gonna get the large 
but then I settled on a medium just because I got the large in the other one so I wanted to have like variation of like oversizedness with my jumpers but yeah this one is so nice and it just gives me such like Christmassy like really kind of mid-winter vibes this is going to keep me so so warm and yeah I absolutely love this how much was this one I think this one was about 30 okay so this one was 25 so really not that bad considering how nice it feels it is a really kind of heavy weight thick cable knit jumper so i think 25 pounds is actually a really like fair price for this right guys so that is it for my haul video i hope you guys enjoyed it i will try and link everything down below as i said and if i can't find anything and it's out of stock i'm really sorry i will try and link an alternative if i can find one but yeah that is it for the video guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did then please make sure you give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already that would be amazing thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye